What's up, everyone? Happy Wednesday. We're from a new location today. I'm trying to switch it up. I've got to find some new places to uh, go hang out, go we'll ride to. And this one, some of you locals may know, that right there is the Southern State Parkway. And this is the uh, tunnel that goes under the parkway. That's a graffiti on it. I don't know why people like to paint on stuff. I kind of like graffiti. I just don't like the way it kind of wrecks natural stuff. But I do like the art side of it. But uh, yeah, this spot over here, there, I think there used to be bike trails in here. We used to ride our bikes in here. There was a course called uh, the Hillies. And we used to jump our bikes in here. And it's, like it's a little overgrown now. Kids don't know what they're missing. I have to trailblaze that again. And this is a uh, creek. Whenever it rains, we get snow melt, all that stuff. This creek here fills up with water. Get some debris in there, and again, it goes under the parkway. Um, back in the day, this was kind of like a scary place when you're young. Should have been in here, probably. Always worried about the teenagers being in here. Uh, or possibly, you know, someone's going to beat us up or something like that. And I think it was all in our heads. Um, it's, uh, just another place. Just another place in the woods. Um, let's go down here. Let's see what's down here. A little exploring. Yeah, there you go. That's what it looks like underneath the Southern State Parkway. That's a graffiti down here. That's a graffiti down here. I'm not spraying the rocks. All right. So, I need a message of the day before my battery goes dead. Message of the day. So, I uh, opened up the Bible app, and there was a verse in there from Peter, basically saying something we say a lot. God gave us all gifts, and we need to use those gifts. If God gave you a voice, a speaking voice, to speak out in the world and speak good into the world, you need to speak good into the world. Uh, maybe you're a strong, quiet type and you like to help people. Get out there and help. Get off the couch and go change the world. God gave us gifts. Each one of us has unique qualities uh, that he gave us to do different tasks. And it's up to each one of us to use our, use our God-given gifts. Uh, if you're an artist, go out and make art. Um, if you're funny, go make people laugh. Um, like I said, if you're a helper, go help. Um, if you're a great communicator, you know, aid in communication. Whatever it is that you're good at, that God gave you, go do it. Go do it. Um, go do what you can do to make the world a better place. Go do what you can do to help people. Um, too many of us sit back on the couch, and we could be making a difference, and yet we don't. We sit there, we let life pass us by. Uh, we don't stand out in the crowd. Um, standing out in the crowd, you know, there's so much average out there. So much average out there. People are just, you know, just existing. And uh, we should be existing. Uh, I went to dinner Saturday night at the Tavern on the Green. And uh, there's a guy, Frank, there. Colorful guy. Well traveled. Uh, artist, designer. Um, tons of stories. Uh, a lot, a lot, a lot of life experience. And you know what? He took over the table. There was, I don't know, eight or ten of us at the table for dinner. And the whole night, he took over the conversation and told us all kinds of fun, crazy stories and entertained us. And you know what? And the whole night, uh, he's what I remember. He's what I remember because he's memorable. He left the mark. And we all need to leave a mark on the people that we meet up with. We shouldn't just blend into the background. We should be standing out in the crowd. We should be having fun. We should be making people smile. We should be communicating. We should be speaking good into people. We should, uh, again, be doing, using our gifts to make a difference in the world. Um, it should be memorable to everybody we meet. Uh, we should leave an impression on everybody we meet, a good impression on everyone we meet. And if you're not, when you think about why you're not and what you can do to make it better. So, here's your message of the day. Use your God-given gifts uh, to do what God put you here to do to make the world a better place. And uh, stand out in the crowd. Be memorable. All right, here's your message. All right, let's jump on here and pray. Sun's coming out. Look at that right up there. In the name of the Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to know what gifts you have given us, and help us to use those gifts to the best of our ability. Help us to change the world. Help us to stand out in the crowd. Help us to be memorable in a good way. Help us to leave lasting good impressions on everyone we come into contact with in our life. Amen. All right, so got your message. We're down here. This is the creek underneath the Southern State Parkway. Uh, this is in the backside of Malvern, Valley Stream, Malvern border. A uh, place where the kids come and hang out. I haven't been in here in years. And uh, yeah, little hidden oasis in here. So it's probably trespassing and whatnot, but whatever. Don't tell on me. Anyway, uh, going to the TWA Hotel tonight for a fundraiser. Um, looking forward to that. I hear that place is really cool. So I'm going with some friends and uh, going for a fundraiser. And, uh, should be a good time. I've been there yet to experience that. Uh, real estate world, West Hempstead is like ridiculously over asking price and going to contract. Uh, they're actually expecting to sign contracts tomorrow. If you're looking to buy this uh, time, um, I'll give you the best help I can give you. If you're looking to sell, man, don't sleep on this market. Like, once it's in contract and uh, closes, you'll, you'll, your head will spin about how, how far this is over asking price. Multiple offers over asking price. And I priced it at uh, basically where it should be selling at. Um, so the market is still crazy. If you're thinking of selling, there's a scramble right now to buy houses with the rates rising. So many buyers out there. So, uh, Let's get, get on board. Let's get your house listed. Let's get it uh, up there. Let's get it sold. And uh, we'll get you ridiculously top dollar for your house. If you're thinking of selling, I wouldn't sleep on it too much more as rates continue to rise. So anyway, here's my commercial for the day. Here's my commercial break. So, all right. Hope everyone's doing well. Maria, I see you on there. How are you? Uh, we got to get together soon. All right, everyone. Have a great day. Great evening, and we will see you tomorrow when the ride continues. Put your head on a pillow every night, knowing you're making the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go.